Okay, so here in a video to explain how the phase lock loop circuit works. Okay, here in the, the screen you get the resonance scanning circuit signal and the the output signal if, if we put on the 250 millimeters roll you can see the waveform is getting like a like a, a soft tooth very slow that charges up the 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 ninth pin of the base lock loop changing its frequency if i change to manual the frequency stays stable and I have to change it with this button okay what I'm going to explain here is how these frequencies work let's take uh, out this for a moment for a moment let's put the gate just for you to see what's going to what's going to happen going here okay here you, you have the gate nice so here you get the frequency range button. It's a four four uh, four four switch button. This is the ten turns offset potentiometer. This is the automatic or manual switch. This is turning turn on the the resonance scanning circuit and set internally to 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 match the, the the frequency this string resistor sets the band width of the of the frequency so that's what i'm that's what i want to explain right now let's begin um, this offset frequency can set the the frequency of the oscillator from a certain value to a max value and this is going to have a certain bandwidth let's say 10 percent let's try to show it here when i get here you see 10 volts actually 10 kilohertz and i try to go to the maximum frequency on the button there this button manual tuning you see I go to 11 kilohertz, almost 11 kilohertz. If I go to the middle, in the middle I have 10 kilohertz. At the, at the lowest, I have nine kilohertz, you see? So uh, if I want to change the center frequency, then I use the offset uh, potentiometer, okay? Let's say I want the center frequency to be the maximum I have here. It, it goes up to 17 kilohertz. So if I get the manual tuning now, go to the maximum, to go to 18.8 kilohertz. And if I go to the minimum, go to 16.4. So you see this is like uh, 10 to 20 percent of the uh, center frequency um, of the sequence the center frequency and that's important because when you switch the auto it's going to switch within that bandwidth and if I want to change it I get I came here to the the trim okay and this trim can set uh, to, to lower or higher bandwidth okay so i can go to very narrow band to uh let's say 10 kilohertz band 20 kilohertz and it will depends on what frequency is the center frequency so let's let's show i'm i am on the second frequency range here and at the at the lowest configuration with the with the button in the middle you see i get let's let's turn off the resonance scanning circuit you see i can go from 2.2 2 
2.2 kilohertz, 2.3 kilohertz, up to 17. I show you, I just show you in the beginning. So let's go there. The upper range, 18 kilohertz. Yeah, it will depends on exactly where is the position of this button. So if I go to the first frequency range, let's let's go scope a little zoom in. So you see it goes from 180 kilohertz, 184 kilohertz at the maximum. If I if I push the manual button to the maximum still it goes to 196 kilohertz that's the uppermost range of the phase lock loop and uh, if I go lower of course it's going to go to 23 23 kilohertz center frequency let's turn down turn down turn down 24 well if i go to the manual tuning at the bottom possible lowest possible you see it goes down to 14 kilohertz up to 31 kilohertz so you see when i change the frequency range and i am the bottom of or the highest portion of the of this offset i may have to change the the bandwidth that I want to tune in. So, of course, we are going to select the frequency of the coil to be the center frequency. And then we set, we, we go there and set the, the bandwidth. And then we can, we are good to go. And so this is it for now. That's only about the, the phase lock loop and how it works. Here you see just the gate frequency this is the dirty cycle, this is the gate frequency, and this is the range, also a switching button, this is a fine tune, a variable capacitance I took out from a radio. So this is it for now, hope you enjoy, this is the full circuit, bye bye.